Before they get out in the field, let's meet up with Travis, who will be introducing the line of Yamaha vehicles the guys will be using to get around on the property today. Yamaha presents Ride Smart. Making sure every ride you have on your ATV or side-by-side -side is a smart ride. Hi, I'm Travis Hollins, Yamaha's ATV Product Planning Manager, and today we've got three vehicles for you to check out. The new 2012 Grizzly 300 is a fully automatic two-wheel drive machine. This class-leading machine has incredible rack capacity, a high and low range automatic transmission, full hydraulic disc brakes both front and rear, and of course shaft drive for incredible durability. Now let's take a look at the Grizzly 700. This is the top of the line model with all the class-leading features. Fuel injected, liquid cooled, single cylinder 700cc motor, four-wheel drive with on-command system including our diff lock, hydraulic disc brakes front and rear, fully automatic transmission with high and low range, and of course the independent suspension, shaft drive, top of the class towing and rack capacities, and of course Yamaha's industry's first electric power steering system. When you load these machines down with all the equipment and all the gear and of course the animals that you're bringing out, that adds a lot more weight to the machine and just puts a lot more stress. So that electric power steering really makes a big, big difference when you're hauling all this gear and equipment and bringing it back. Yamaha started the side-by-side -side category with the Rhino introduction back in 2003. What we were trying to achieve back then and still today is a machine that can really have the off-road capability of an ATV, but you could actually bring somebody along for the ride. All right, there you have it. Three great examples of Yamaha's incredible ATV and side-by-side -side lineup. The Grizzly 300, the Grizzly 700, and the Rhino 700. To find out more about these models, go to your local Yamaha dealership or yamaha-motor.com. For more on this show or to watch a full episode of the show, visit whitetaildiaries.com.